uh, it turns out that um, during the last update of the game something happened as you can see there's nothing on any of my positions no people all these beds are empty and as you can see in the corner you can see in this corner there's zero beds it says but we can clearly see that we have beds so something happened and I have exactly 300 food and exactly 300 arrows so something and I have two flags I don't know how that happened either so I need to kind of um, replace the beds again and um, figure out how oh, figure out how I'm gonna get everything back because it's gonna be a problem with um, if I only hire just as many people as I had before I think it was 15 or something they might take jobs and 300 food is not a lot which means they, they might go to some profession which is not gonna give me food oh my god that means I have nothing here also. Oh, I lost all my materials. That is terrible. Well, well. Uh, I'm just gonna try it out and see how it goes and try to fill up the positions that we only need here. And something happened now. That's there. So, I will see so, you later. Welcome back. Uh, we have... Um, <laughs> gotten some of our colonists back that means we have picked up all these beds in all this building and also changed all the things in this and taken away everything in the mines and just replaced every single thing because I didn't realize that you actually to make this work that you actually need to take away all the workstations it's ridiculous and even worse than that was that I needed to manually go to the field here and take away every single one of these on every level to plant a new field because they would not recognize it as a field anymore uh, that took like half an hour just to do that so I took away all the beds here all the boxes because they would not recognize the boxes which means they would go all the way down to the flag to get their resources which is not what I wanted so all of these fields I've been replacing and as you can see there oh that does not look good uh, can I jump from here without dying oof 21 uh, I just want this to make look good so I'm gonna try to just uh, start making a real good looking wall here so you can actually walk on top of this wall without anything happening because right now it looks kind of lacklust with just <laughs> two brick wall and honestly a real fort would not look like that so I'm gonna make it look real nice so you can walk inside of this wall all the way if you want to and you can also get up through all of them in these, this fashion and does this look weird? Hmm. So I'm making these so I can put my soldiers on these things and just shoot down. But I also want to bring this water. I think I'm bringing it underground here and just putting it up around the whole fort. But we'll see. And I also need to finish this. But I started it last time, was, And the thing about these special bricks is that they need to be created. And because I lost all my miners and all my people, there's no one's making this anymore so it's gonna take quite a while to just create those and I I just want the food level because I, I almost died in this game honestly because I was at as you can see now it's 200 which is pretty good and I use 40 a day but I was down at like 30 and I had to like scramble uh, to just take away some of the workstations and uh, because I hired a guard, which is kind of stupid when I can guard myself with my bow. But I just wanted to be lazy because I wanted to uh, basically build up my fort at the same time I was building up my, uh, my walls and stuff like that around me. But now it seems fairly good. I mean, it's stable now, so I'm gonna... <laughs> soon and uh, next morning I'm probably gonna start with uh, filling up my mind with people and stuff like that making everything looks nice and after that we can get back to normal business well I will 
see you guys later when I actually have uh, fulfilled this. It's probably gonna take more than half an hour to just create everything back to what it was. So welcome back. We'll talk to you later. I have uh, expanded a little bit on top of this tower. I don't know how many floors I have now, but and I don't want to fall down because I'm probably gonna die then. I have no idea what happens if you die in this game. So. As you can see, I'm starting on the wall here. You can see where I've been digging out. I'm gonna need to continue that. Put the water around this and finish this thatch roof. Actually, I have some of these now. I can actually finish it. Not finish it, maybe with 21, but can at least start it. So I put in all the miners and put in a new field up here so I can get some more wheat to make some bread for the colonists. And I'm just gonna go down. So I have uh, one up there, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven. That's good. And you can see here I can walk seven of these. So I can walk all the way in here and then fall down. <laughs> Um, yeah, I don't really know what to do with this. I'm gonna make some cool kind of a construction in here. Maybe uh, some kind of. Uh, let's see if I can find something on the internet that I can construct, like a likeness or something for my YouTube channel. Maybe I make a picture on this wall or something like that that would be awesome but i mean i'm just gonna continue developing this base and hopefully these two guys can keep all the zombies out i don't have too many colonists at right at this time so it should be fine so i will uh see you when i have uh, done some construction and uh, we are have expanded a little bit uh, we have more guards because apparently they all died the last night because yeah, there's, because we have 18 uh, settlers or colonists, it becomes a little bit uh, too much for uh, the ones we have to defend us. So I had to step in and actually save some of my colonists. Uh, I've expanded outwards here because of one reason, and that is because this one was getting so high and I don't want to... Honestly, I have no idea what happens if I die, and I don't want to lose the whole progression. So I'm building on top of this one. So I'm going to do one on this side and one on this side, and then I'm going to just continue the same way upwards. So just basically build on my giant tower. I'm still going to make more floors because I want to reach the sky. See how high you want to go. And I also want to dig a hole into the ground and see how low you can go in this game also. Because of all of this... I'm just gonna make my first flex farm here first before I continue my thought there. Uh, we're gonna hire someone for tomorrow, and there we go. Because flex, I have no idea what it is, but it's used for a lot of products. I pr should probably look it up on the internet what the word flex means. More than like flexing. Uh, because it's used for making a lot of products here like uh, flex for this one for example and oh we need uh, someone who makes coins and stuff like that minter gold ingots we have gold why is no one making gold ingots then hmm i have to take a look at that later shouldn't it be this one who make smelt gold infinite infinite I mean, we should have plenty. Oh, we have gold ingots. Let's make uh, one of these then. Oh, a minter. Finally. There we go. We put you in here. Is there any other jobs that I don't have? Shop. I don't know what a shop is, but we're going to make it later. Linseed oil. Yeah. Uh, oh yeah, we can make those special coated planks then. Adobe? No, I don't know what that is. We're going to take a look at that later. But for now, I am just going to... I'm going to make a hole here after uh, we're all done. Because this 
mine, which I'm mining all the different ones, it's getting quite big. And I just want to continue down into the earth and see how far we can actually go. Maybe it's possible to reach some point in this game where you cannot go any further. I'm gonna reach that later, so see you then. Uh, we're back, and I'm gonna try out uh, just digging my way down and try to figure out how I'm gonna get up from there. It's gonna be quite hard, but uh, my colonists are fine for the moment, and I'm just gonna try to dig my way out. Let's see if. Uh, oh, yeah, we need an empty spot because we also need this material. We also need stone to make uh, something more. What? is going on so if I dig like this I can't go any deeper huh so I can actually dig for myself this material if I really wanted to which is ridiculous because my miners do it so much faster than I can or <gasps> I have no one standing on coal I'm an idiot there we go mm -mm, mm -mm. because I now I started to dig more for more gold remove and we're gonna take you on coal you have no pickaxe of course you don't uh, planks yep we are shit out of luck on that because we have no planks. I used them up all for making the floor on my buildings and my fort. So I'm gonna need to go farm some planks. Actually, you can make a forest to do that for you, but I don't wanna waste the time, honestly. And this looks kind of nice. I don't wanna destroy these trees. I'm gonna go out in the forest and do it far out. So it's you can see here coming about quite nicely. I'm gonna make two guard towers at the front gate to make it look a little bit more like a fort. Oh, so I finished uh, the wall pretty much and I made the two towers here in front so it's getting quite a big little thing and I made a massive job here on the trench here because we need a trench. I should probably put something in here yeah uh, just for the moment so the zombies have something nice to go on so uh, all the zombies need to funnel in right here now and we have a bunch of guard guarding this and it's nice that's kind of nice and i have some on the side also so they will go there also uh, now i will release the water so right now I made a dam around the whole thing that took wow so much time <laughs> I wasted so much time of my life just doing this you can see here uh, because it needs to be a certain width depth I think because when I release one of these the whole water is just gonna flow in that direction so I'm just gonna start by releasing this how many am I gonna release Hmm, maybe I do it like, fill it in like this. And then, fill it in like this. And, yeah. I don't think we need to. We can see after we have released everything. If I release that one, that one, that one, that one, that one. And you can see the water is just flowing in. And I want to go up here. Come on. Let me. There we go. And there we go. Ah! Come on. And. Sadly, we cannot get it up to the level I want. I don't know how we're gonna fix that. We probably need to put bricks here. So like, it looks, uh-oh. I have nowhere to go. Oh, maybe, oh yeah. 
an idiot. Do it fast until the water comes. And now I need to get up before the water comes. Why am I doing two? I'm not making steps anymore. There we go! You can see, hopefully, why is the water not coming on this side? Maybe it had longer to travel. Oh yeah, there it comes. Nice! Took me so much time to do this, so has to be looking nice at least. There we go, and it's night time, so I need to look out for the zombies. But this guy is gonna protect me. Come on. Water! Nice. Good, good, good. And there we have it. We have the whole trench filled. And we have these guards here. I think I'm gonna expand a little bit so it's a longer bridge for them to go by. Because right now they can come in pretty much directly. And you can see our my nice houses here. And I think I'm gonna go up at the highest point and just look down at my creation. I should make a watchtower, like a overview tower. The whole place so I can see if it's all looking good from above. I wish there was like kind of a ghost mode in this game. Maybe there is a button for it. We'll see. Oh my god. And... Oh no! You can't see it from here! God damn it! You can see me expanded. Uh, oh, you can only see a little bit. We need to get higher if we need to see the outside the walls. But you can see here, it's looking pretty nice. And I should take this. And I should make some kind of structure here also. Otherwise, across from this, because we're gonna need a house soon that can hold more of my employees. Because we are getting kind of full on the places I have them on right now. And did I make one here? Yeah. Should just have uh, finished this one. Is that all that I missed? No, here also. Why have I not closed this one? Oh yeah. There we go. So as you can see, um, it's looking pretty nice right now and I think I'm gonna quit it there for today because yeah, I might play a little bit longer but I will not film it because I will just tidy things up before going. It's quite late and I know my wife will come home soon and she uh, probably not impressed what I've been doing on this game, sadly enough. <laughs> So I guess I'll see you guys later. Thank you for watching and if you have any suggestion how you want me to proceed or what, what you want to see in this game or what you want me to build, just send me a comment and I will try to create it. Thank you all. It's strangely addicting this, this game. Honestly, I played it for now like three hours. It just feels like ten minutes. <laughs> anyway, bye bye.